All right, Shalom. Call Halayim La Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh Shah Ba'ashim Rakha Kodash. Double honor to my elders and my apostles at Great Millstone who rule well for teaching me this truth. And salutation to you, I came out there in the four corners laboring in this truth and pushing with all righteousness and sincerity. And to you, confusion of face, brothers who don't look like your average everyday Israelite, so called Negro, Latino, and Native American, but you are according to the Holy Scriptures. And to you, I say Shalom. There's the brother Kaya High here coming back at you with, uh, with another video through the spirit, man. You know, just going into how, um, you know, how brothers need to be on the same accord in the truth, man. You know, like this truth is basically like a game of follow the leader. OK, Simon says, if you will. But this is what Yahweh Shai says. OK, and if a brother or brothers ain't on the same accord, then you how about then you got to try them, brothers. You got to prove them, you know. And then the Lord uh, 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 sift them, man, you know, because it's house cleaning. That's a, it's always going to be a house cleaning and a house in the body of Yahweh Shah Mashiach. Okay? So with that being said, this is the book of Amos, chapter 3, verse 3. It says, can two walk together except they be agreed? All right? And that's the point right there. It says, can two walk together except they be agreed? So if, if two brothers is on the same accord, and then in the name of Yahweh Hashem Hashem, because the scriptures say what? If two or three are gathered in my, uh, gathered in my name, there I am in the midst. Matter of fact, let's get that right quick, just to you know further prove that point. Um, two, three. My name. I think this is somewhere in the New Testament. Here we go. Yep, Con. This is the book of Matthew, chapter eighteen, verse twenty. It says, "For where two or three are gathered in my name, so like it would. For where two or three are gathered together in my name, there I am." In the midst of them. Yeah. It's, uh, and that's red letter, man. I see how was y'all talking. The Lord said, if two or three are gathered together in my name, there I am in the midst of them. Okay? Because they they all speaking this, uh, the same spiritual thing, which are what? The words of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh All right? The law, statutes, and commandments. Okay? In holy conversation. In righteous, separate conversation from the world. Okay? So, let's go back to that... um. To that Amos right quick, you know, because I want to make a point. It says, can two walk together except they be agreed? All right. And the answer to that question is no, because if those persons don't agree, then they're not on the same accord. Then they're not they're not together. All right. They're, they're not together spiritually. They're not together uh, mentally and so on and so forth, man. All right. So if you got a brother or well, if you got uh, if you got a person or a man speaking contrary to the doctrine or acting contrary to the doctrine, well, then he, he might not be good. He, well, he won't be good for the body. That ain't no mites. He's not good for the body, man. And you got to get rid of you got to get rid of guys like that, man. Okay. All right. So <clears throat> two can't walk together. Two cannot walk together except they be agreed, man. All right. If because if both of us ain't talking about Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shah, then we ain't really talking about nothing, man. All right. What is there left to talk about the the world? There's nothing else in the world that we that we love or look forward to. All right, but if you got one, if you got one person who's trying to go back to the world, and another person who's trying to stay in the truth, you know what I'm saying, and do righteously, you got to separate yourself from that person, man. All right, because what they they teaching, they move, they move and they act in contrary to the doctrine. All right, they moving against the doctrine, okay, and that's wickedness. All right. So with that being said, let's get this other scripture in the book of um. Second Corinthians chapter six, verse fourteen. It says, "Be not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness, and what communion hath light with darkness?" Okay, and the answer is there is no communion between light and darkness, man. Because when you're in the light, you're in the truth. Okay, and we all know the truth is Yahweh Shimei All right. Specifically talking about Yahweh Shah himself, man. Yahweh Shah is the truth. Okay, so what what communion? Let's get this word right quick. This is G2842. It says fellowship, association, community, communion, joint participation, intercourse, the share which one has in anything, participation. Okay. Matter of fact, oh, this that first definition uh, of uh, this definition one is heavy. It says the right hand as a sign and pledge of fellowship. Fulfilling the apostolic office. Okay, we are in the apostolic office right now, starting with our elders and our apostles of Great Millstone. Okay, this is a pledge. So if you got somebody in the body that's not taking the same pledge as everybody else, 
then there's a chance that that person ain't right, man. Okay. Again, it's a, it's always gonna be a house cleaning in the body of uh, in the body of Yahabashi Malsha, man. You gotta cut out the cancers, man. Okay. Because what they again they they moving against the doctrine. Okay. If they're not being brotherly, then they then they being wicked, man. Okay. If they still getting lineups, then they not being righteous and so on and so forth, man. There's many things to go into, man. All right. If they are not uh, uh, proving themselves unto unto love and good works concerning the scriptures, all right, concerning the truth, well then you gotta you gotta get them out, man. Okay. That's why it says be be ye not e unequally yoked together with unbelievers. Okay. And there's many ways to show unbelief in the truth, man. Okay. Which means what you you going against you going up against the elders and apostles, all right, the brothers in the camp, and so on and so forth, man. Are right, you you not following the scriptures to the best of your ability, man? You not examining examining yourself, okay? There are many there are many ways to uh, show that you're an unbeliever, man. Okay, and that's why uh, every single brother in Great Millstone, okay, in any camp that's rightfully teaching how about Shem Al Shah gets tried and proved every single day, man. Okay. So it says, be ye not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. All right, you can't be around those guys, man. All right, how about Shemar Shah is proving uh, uh, whether or not these guys is right or not every single day, man. Okay? It says, what fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness? Okay? And this mainly, this is this is mainly why we don't be with two thirds, man. All right, this is why it's not this is why it's not uh, uh, good to be hanging around uh, uh, two thirds, man. All right, because what they wicked as all hell, man. All right, if I'm teaching how about Shema Shah and he's teaching Yeshua Hamashiach or Jesus Christ and so on and so forth, man, we can't be with those guys. That's why Great Millstone, all right, in DTA and all the sincere brothers teaching you how about Shema Shah is not dealing with uh, the comfy guys, the Nates and the Yohannes and so on and so forth because they're unbelievers, man. They don't believe in Yahweh Shah. That's why we don't. That's why we don't rock with them guys, man. Okay. Because them guys ain't right. All right? Yeah, how about Shema Shah denied them, man? That's why brothers got to be on the same uh, spiritual accord, man. All right? The scriptures say what? And they all did eat the same spiritual meat. So if Nate and Yohan ain't, see, you know, ain't eating the same spiritual meat as, uh, as the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone, okay? Then we can't be on the same accord, man. We can't be together. All right? The next scripture I'm going to get... It's, um, Slaki, just bear with me. Yeah, the next scripture I'm going to get is in the book of Romans. Go up. No, 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 it's right here. Slaki, I can just bear with me. All right, it's right here in the book of Romans, chapter 16, verse 17. All right. It says now, I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which ye have learned and avoid them. OK, it says mark them that cause divisions. Let's uh, go to that word mark right quick. It says G 46, 48. It says to look at, observe, contemplate, mark to fix one's eyes upon, direct one's attention to anyone to look to take heed to thyself. Yeah, man, you got to pay attention to somebody who's. Who's uh, uh, not moving spiritually, man? Okay, who's moving according to their own uh, uh, lust in their own fashion, and so on and so forth, man? All right, you you gotta you gotta look at those guys, man. You gotta pay attention to them. You gotta try them. All right, that's what Yahweh Shah does, man. Yahweh Shah has always been doing that. Okay. Yeah, right, you gotta. The scriptures say what? Uh, I believe not every spirit, man. You gotta try the spirit by the spirit, man. Okay. And if and if uh, uh, one man is not moving according to the doctrine, okay, you you gotta. It says what? It says um um uh mark. All right, consider, take heed to, pay attention to. All right, you gotta examine that. You gotta examine that dude, man. All right, because there may be a chance. There might be a chance that he ain't right, man. All right, but again, that's why your how about Shimmy how is always is always a uh, 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 for like a better word wa washing the body, man. Okay, he's always washing the body. All right. And it's all spirits at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? That's as to as to why a lot of these guys are are either leaving or getting kicked out and so on and so forth. 
It's because it's because what, man? It's, it, more demons is coming down than ever before, man. Why? Because we at the end of this thing, man. Okay. So if they start going all crazy and stuff like that and moving contrary to the doctrine of Yahweh Hashem Hashem, hey, then they not right, man. And the scriptures say what? Mark them which cause divisions. All right, so in discord. Okay. That's why I started off with that scripture. Can two walk together except they be agreed? All right. If they if they not if they not moving. Like the whole body is moving. Well, then they're going to get left behind, man. Okay, and the cancer is going to get weeded out. All right, the weed is going to get rooted. And so on and so forth, man. Okay? So with that being said, I'm going to... Um... Yeah, yeah, that's all I want to get on that. You know? So with that being said, Lord willing, Akim was edified, man. Hey, just continue to stay on the same accord. In the same spirit. Matter of fact, let me add it off this scripture. Now I can find it through here. You know, this this is always an important scripture to uh, take heed to. All right, this is 1 Corinthians 14 and 40. It says, let all things be done decently in the order. Okay? you a hey, brothers got to continue to walk with each other, man. Not not against each other, man. All right? Because Yahweh Hashem shall see that. All right? And hey, he, that's why he's taking these guys out because they 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 not follow order or they got a problem with order and so on and so forth. All right, but that's why the scripture right here is important, man. It says let all things be done decently and in order. Okay, so if you let's 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 say if you you just a foot so you just a foot soldier trying to talk to the captain, you're not going straight to the captain. Now you're going to the the uh, the, the few people in between. In order to talk to the captain and so on and so forth, man, you're, you're superior, okay? There's an order to things, man. But if somebody is going against the order, all right, and, and has a problem with that and moving against it, well, then that person ain't right, man, okay? That person is 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 unstable, okay, for the body, all right? That's why there's an order to everything, man, all right? An organization, that's what this, that's what this, uh, the, the body of Yahweh Shah is, an organization, man, Okay? So with that being said, call Allah Yimla, Yahabashimi Hawashah, Hey, Shalom.